Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Two Shot here from Two Shot Gamer. I'm just doing a quick little, little update for you. I'm gonna look at the camera. I got a lot of new stuff over the last couple days, so this is gonna be like an update. What's going on with the channel? Um, it's gonna be Monday. This is really Sunday night. I just got in from work. I don't have a lot of time, so I just want to show you a couple things what's coming up in the, and that's gonna be new for the channel. Cause um, I always, oh, I got I got a new pop filter. And if I just made noise to the mic, I apologize. Whatever. It's a new mic I'm trying out. I had it for a while. I just never used it. It's the um, Snowball. It seems like it does a lot more noise canceling. So I'm hoping that'll help a little bit. I've been using it a little bit here and there. If you see, like, the last couple weeks, uh, hopefully the sound's improved a little bit. I had a Yeti, but for some reason, like, I'm in the basement. You can see with the back wall and everything. That the basement picks up so much, like, ambient noise, surround sound. Noise, like, surrounding noise. That I just can't do it without something. You know, and then sometimes when I mess with the audio, if it don't come out perfect, people start thinking I use voice mods and stuff, so like, whatever, I don't, you know, whatever. I am feeling better, but I didn't get a lot done. I live streamed a couple times, but um, I want to show you some things that's coming up with the, like, Tech Tummies, Tech Tuesdays, the Tuesday shows, Mad Pack should be coming out uh, Tuesday. If anything, Mad Pack should definitely come out on Tuesday. I look for some mods, mods really, there's really nothing great out there yet. You know, Optifine's out, I showed you how to do that. Forge is out, that's really early. I found a real early copy of 1.8, like a developer's build almost. It works, it does everything it's supposed to do. I think Better better Leather is out, I got that on the channel. Too Many Items is out, that's been out for a while. That video does great, so anybody that watched that video that found my channel, thank you so much for checking this out, it's really cool. That, like, thank you for liking the video, subscribing, and joining. It's almost at 100,000 views, and maybe it's getting close to two months now. So that, that's awesome. I always want to show this. This is um, the motherboard I got. It's an Asus Z97 Pro motherboard. It's awesome. It's got five-way optimization. Optimization. It's optimized. It's like, it helps you overclock everything you need to do. I'm working a lot. Hopefully this ain't bad. Like for me, the video looks a little weird. So if it comes out a little weird, I'm sorry. Um, this is really quick. I'm throwing it together. Uh, that board has been great. That's what started this whole thing. Um, what do I got here? This is a video I'm going to do hopefully for Text Tuesday very soon. It's a um, NZXT sleeve lighting kit. Okay, there's the camera. Just point it towards the camera. If you can see that. It hooks up to the um, one of your um, expansion slots in the back of your PCs right here. Right here. Right here. And um, I'm gonna like take. We're gonna take it apart. I'm gonna upgrade my computer. So I'm gonna show you how to put this lighting kit in. It looks really easy. I never did it before, but serious. How hard can it be? I did my whole computer myself, so I figure it's not gonna be that hard. So um. Oh, another thing I picked up is that I got um a DPI cable because I got a new monitor, a BenQ monitor, which um I I'm using it because I'm testing it out before I do like a little review on it for the tech for the tech dummy. Let's do this. Alright. That's a bad view of it. But I just realized you probably can't hear me without the mic. It's an LX Ultimate Esports Gaming Monitor by BenQ. It is pretty cool. Let's um, try to talk about it. Give me a second. We are back. <laughs> it's a BenQ monitor. It's LX2720Z. Just so you guys know. It goes like this. Tell you real quick. I'm going to do a review and talk about it a lot, a lot better in the review. But it's like, um, it does 60 hertz, does 120 hertz, does 144 hertz. It's got a real nice um, beveled edge to it. It looks beautiful. I'm going to show a lot of it. In the back, you got somewhere to put your headphones. I'm going to game a little bit before I go to sleep. That's why I'm all ready to game. Just so you know. And I'm on all the crap I have in the back. I'm, I have so much crap right now that I'm still trying to figure out a way to kind of get it all set up. So, and it's got this, um, it's got this really cool leather i don't want to open it all up but it's a screen protector it goes over the screen when you're not using it it's supposed to be like for portable gaming my plan is to have three of these things i used to have a 32 inch um samsung like 720p it was fine it was nothing great i came from console gaming if you guys can understand that so like i wasn't you know i wasn't i didn't understand how a gaming experience could be on pc i'm starting to learn that the last like year or so uh, so, um, what else? What else? What else? Just so you guys know. Uh, oh, Samsung. 
Evo A40 Samsung SSD. It is um, 250 gigabytes. I used to have a 180. Actually, there's a one. There's a 120 around here somewhere. For some reason, I got the 120 first. Oh, here it is. Hold on. I'm sorry with the camera. This is what I'm gonna have to get used to, like moving around so much. And I'm, I have an actual video camera that does 720p, but that's what I'm gonna try to do the unboxes with. This is the 120 gig one. I got it and I'm like, wait, I, I have 180. What's a 120 gonna do for me? So I got the 250, I'm gonna send back to 120. And then we're gonna do, um, I'm gonna show you how to clone your drive. It's pretty cool, there's software inside that um, Evo. Then I'm gonna show you how to um, change it in and out. Now, oh, one more thing that I have. I have more stuff coming. But um, what has one now out there? I kind of mentioned this early. Holy crap, there's dust on the box for some reason. This is, um, can I get a good? All right. Um, EVGA A50 G2. It's a, a 850 watt gold power supply. It's really cool, it's really efficient, man. I'll tell you more about that and we'll do like an unboxing of it. I'm not gonna really do anything else. With that, I'll do your unboxing, show you how it works, give, leave the links. I think I got that on Amazon, so I'll leave the link in there. Wherever I can find the kind of cheap, I'm gonna leave links for you in those videos. And um, I would love to go over my computer, man. When I get my computer, I'm getting um, an EVGA um, a 980, uh, super overclocked. And we're gonna show you, we're gonna go through videos how to overclock for like a novice, for easy overclocking. If you guys are technical and know exactly how to overclock better, and this is the real way to do it. I'm trying to do it so guys that have safe overclocks and how they can get a little more performance out of their computer. Not that it go high end, uh, how, like sometimes you can burn out your components, like kill the life on them a little bit. I'm not about teaching people how to do that. You know, I know how to do that. I'd rather do it the safe way, get a nice overclock. I gotta, um, why can't I remember stuff? This is not, this is not gonna happen in a real show. Like sometimes I have everything right in my head and now I don't have nothing in my head. I think it's like a 4770K. It's a K so you can overclock it. It's like Turbo Boost, 4-Core processor, uh, Intel uh, i7, and I could be wrong with the 4790. It might be 4790, 4970, something like that. And um, it's a 3.5 um, base, which I overclocked to 4.6, 4.7 now, because I just redid everything the other day. Uh, my old graphics cards are MS MSI 750Ti, which is still pretty good. It's like an energy saver one that you can play games on, but it's, you know, I, I need, I want another boost. So I'm getting the um, EVGA 980 graphics card. You know, if you guys, I, I think they're pretty cool. I think the graphics card's like five something. You know, it's, um, I looked at all of them. I really like the, the Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Asus, like I like an Asus, I call it. That's how I see it, like with the motherboards. I really like their wrong graphics card. They're 980, but the thing is, is that right now it's so hard to find one, and people are overpricing them. Like I think they're supposed to be like around 600 to 700. Like after they do all their upgrades and everything to it, because I don't want the stock one. I want something upgraded. And um, right now they're putting at the prices like like 900, a thousand dollars because there is a short demand. So, um, EVGA has got like really good stuff there, really good quality. So, I, I wanted to go with them. Because, the plus, I, I didn't want to wait. These are lights. You, know, you see how my lights are always weird? I'm going to show like a low cost way of getting a lot of light in a room that just wants to soak up all the light and make it dark as possible. One of the parts are on back order. So, hopefully, I can get that set up really soon. Maybe in the next couple weeks. There's gonna, I got a lot of stuff to set up for this video. So, I'm hoping that, you know. Open stuff up, help a little out a little bit. I'm gonna get big on cameras hopefully over the winter. And um, if everything works out, works crazy. And hope I'm gonna try to keep up with work. And keep, well, I have to keep up with work. I'll keep up with work, keep up with the channel. And we'll have some um, cameras set up, or like a three monitor set up so we can watch me play and stuff. Like, I think it's gonna be pretty cool. Like, stuff like that for like a live stream and stuff like that. We're gonna do live streaming. We've been live streaming a lot. I kind of went back to Twitch, if you guys don't know. You know, we just been doing it for fun. I haven't like I think once or twice I tried it on YouTube. YouTube was giving me some problems. Uh, I put out that little 60 FPS in Advanced Warfare. Looks like everything came out great. Looks the game looks awesome, but I got some 
weird copies of strike that I'm researching now and I think it's total bullcrap. But um it looks like there's companies out there that are just copywriting advanced warfare and now it's not unmonetized. I can't monetize it and YouTube tell me they won't get back to me in like two months. So I'm like, it's just stupid. I'm like I don't even know if I'm doing advanced warfare. Maybe I'll live stream it. Which I gotta check the rules. Well, I guess it doesn't matter because I don't get paid to live stream, it's just for fun. But I can't probably live stream on YouTube. I'm gonna have to go to Twitch. Alright, so um, that's a quick update, hopefully. Hopefully it's quick. I don't know, it was long. Thank you so much for watching. And, um, yeah, tell me what you like about this, what you want. You know, like, kind of leave comments, tell me what I can approve, what I can't approve. What I can approve, or what I shouldn't approve. I'm thinking the background needs improvement. I got some foam. Foam. Back there, I'm gonna put on the walls to try to help with the sound. It's fun. It's like fun doing this stuff, so I figured you guys deserve it. Alright, so hopefully over the winter there will be a lot of upgrades and a lot of cool stuff coming out. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time. Peace!